I'm Lucas, I'm the lead producer of Little Nightmares for Bandai Namco Entertainment Europe. I've been involved in uh, Little Nightmares since uh, the beginning of the first game and I'm really excited to see the fans' reactions when Little Nightmares 2 will come out. So Little Nightmares 2 will release on February 11th, 2021. This is a bit later than what we originally anticipated, uh, but this is due to basically two factors. Uh, of course, the COVID situation didn't really help us like for any game production, but that's actually not the main reason uh, for this. The main reason is that simply the game needed more time, the game needed more love, and we want to reassure uh, the community that we're doing our best to release the best game possible and to meet all the fans' expectations. Today, we are also very happy to announce that uh, Little Nightmares 2 will release on PlayStation 5, Xbox Series X later in 2021. All PlayStation 4 and Xbox One users will be able to get a free upgrade uh, for the next generation. In addition to uh, the new trailer and the release date announcement, we are very pleased to show at Gamescom this year for the first time a 15-minute gameplay footage of the game. And we are very happy to show everyone how the game has evolved since the first opus. So in Little Nightmares 2, you will play our new hero, Mono, the little guy with the paper bag. And uh, he will wake up in a very strange and uh, eerie wilderness setting. He will understand very soon that the world is corrupted by the humming sound of the transmission from the signal tower. He will start moving on on a journey and he will meet our hero from the first game, Six. Together they decide to track the source of the transmission to discover the dark secret of the signal tower. Everything is better in Little Nightmares 2. So the first thing is that for the first time you're going to venture outside of the mall, so you're going to have a lot of outdoor places. Exploration will be emphasized. The world is, is just bigger, vaster. Also in Little Nightmares 2 we introduce a new gameplay mechanic. Uh, one of them is the combat, where you'll be able to pick up objects and defend yourself against uh, middle-sized enemies. Of course, uh, in Little Nightmares 2, you already know that you have Six with you as an AI companion. That relationship is really unique, uh, and we are very confident that this is gonna uh, deliver uh, an experience that is very different from the first game. We've improved uh, controls uh, since the first game, and uh, also Little Nightmares 2 will be about twice the size of uh, Little Nightmares 1. Despite being called Little Nightmares 2, 
the game is a self-contained experience. So you don't need to uh, play Little Nightmares 1 to understand what's going on in Little Nightmares 2. However, of course, we have uh, a nice story that uh, is connected to the first game and the fans and the community will be delighted to find pieces of lore in, in the new game. While we got rid of the claustrophobic corridors from the mall, Little Nightmares 2 is keeping the same kind of atmosphere as Little Nightmares 1. So you will have some scary moments, but at the same time we're not doing a pure horror game. Uh, everything is in the atmosphere and the mood and also the resident that you will meet during your journey. Uh, definitely Little Nightmares 2 is not a great place for visitors, for those children who are here in this world trying to survive. So we recommend that uh, Little Nightmares 2 is played only by people uh, 16 and above. Our new hero Mono uh, has different capacities compared to 6. So he's able to pick up objects in the uh, environment and use them as a weapon uh, in the game. So he might be able to fight back enemies that are attacking him uh, or he might also be using objects to solve puzzle and progress to the next room. Little Nightmares 2 uh, is combining uh, platforming, horror, uh, hide and snake. We're adding on the top of that uh, some action with uh, combat, of course, but we want to remain faithful to our atmosphere, which is so singular. So this is not becoming an action game per se. Uh, we see it as uh, an enrichment to uh, the current recipe, but uh, this is not a shift. The tall character that you've seen in the trailer is called the Thin Man. He is the main antagonist of Little Nightmares 2. He is the main foe behind the signal tower and he's relentlessly chasing Mono and Six in the game. So you've already seen the Thin Man in the trailer. You can see that he has a, a very unique capability to chase you and that's very interesting. Uh, and there's another one uh, for which you also have a very, very uh, subtle um, glimpse in the trailer. He is uh, located in the most creepy chapters of the game and he will really give you a hard time. He's really unique and that's what makes Little Nightmares uh, actually different from other games is how unique and authentic are the monsters that you can, you can meet everywhere.